Do you want to water draw and what age animation? Okay, so let's get started. First, add the square from the shapes and adjust the scale. Add the flip layer effect optional. And increase the access into 90 degrees. And change the angle into minus 70.0 degrees. Okay, so let's make the water drop. So add the shape called chair drop. You can change the color as you like. Choose the radial gradient fill. The inner of the water color must be white and the outer of the water color must be blue. Okay, now let's adjust the scale. Okay, so time to animate the water. Adjust the location of the water and add the first keyframe and change the location at the second keyframe will be automatically added. Now, let's make our animation look smoother. Go to animation easing, choose the ease out graph or I'll give the graph curve in description. Okay, so let's decrease the scale by using keyframes. Have the middle of the symbol to change into freeze time scale. At the keyframe of the middle of the highlight and decrease the scale of the height. Use the ease out graph. Now, let's make the fade out transition. So, go to Blending and opacity and add the keyframe of middle of the timeline and decrease the all opacity. Also choose the ease out graph. Now let's make our water draw realistic. So duplicate the layer of the teardrop. Cut the above of the teardrop layer and add the effect called glass. The glass effect is in distortion warp. Increase the radius into 82.3. If you done, change into light source and let's change the color and shine into blue. And go to material and increase the shine to the end. Now our water draw is more realistic than ever. If you then select the two teardrop layers and group them. Now let's talk about the theory of the water drop and what age. When the water is drowning into paper or clothes something, the what age is visible. So let's use this technique. So add the fashion drawing layer and draw the shape of the water drop what age. Just draw the shape by tapping the points. I will draw it faster because you will get bored. Speed 3.0x. If you then don't forget to lock the points. Now let's curve the point by tapping the curve points. To what edge shape look more realistic? Curve it and edit in the points. Speed run 8.6x. You don't need to change the color, it's just optional because I want to change the color. You don't need to follow the step. Now, time to animate the what edge. So, go to keyframe editing mode. Add the keyframe to all points of the end of the timeline. You must add the keyframe to all of the points. If you then add the keyframe, go to the first of the timeline and shrink all of the points to look smaller. If you then add the easing graph to look more smoother, use ease out graph. I will give the curve in the description. Copy curve and paste to all of between the keyframes.
if you done pasting the graph, add the effect called copy background. To visible the wet edge, add the effect called brightness contrast. Tap the standard settings. Add the keyframe to brightness of the first timeline and decrease the brightness into minus 10% of middle of the timeline. Paste the easing graph to look at the same direction. Now our water drop and watch edge look more and more realistic. So there's only one step to make our watch edge look more realistic. So add the effect called Gaussian Blur. Increase the stretch into 0 0.140. Now our water drop and what edge look more realistic than ever. So, so how's your result? This is my result. That's all for now. If you like this video, like and share this video and subscribe my channel to see my other videos and other tutorials. So goodbye. Subscribe!